Welcome to my world. It's a universe of robots, and what might surprise you is that we've been making robots for centuries. A new exhibit at London Science Museum traces 500 years of robotic development, from early clockwork automation, such as this impressive silver swan from 1773, to interactive droids. The show features over 100 robots, including some which earn their living by working, just like the development, the definition of robot has evolved over the centuries. Robots themselves have existed as automated beings that are capable of being programmed for many, many hundreds of years. We begin the story at the Science Museum 500 years ago, which is when we have our earliest artifacts on display. But really, in um, literature and archives, you see evidence of robots going even further beyond that. The word robot was reportedly first used in 1920. Since then, they have appeared in various guises in popular culture. Maria featured in the 1927 science fiction film Metropolis. T-800 Terminator in Terminator Salvation. You also see Cobots and Show, collaborative robots which carry out precise tasks. But how much should we let robots invade our lives and work? It's a question that we invite people to consider in the exhibition. We have uh, visitors to be able to come and see uh, three collaborative humanoid robots that are actually working in factories alongside people today. Um, but it's, it's a serious question, you know, to what degree do we want to let these robots into our everyday lives and to what degree do we want them to do work for us? Centuries of robotic development has allowed scientists to replicate the human image with increasing detail and complexity. But would any of them pass the Turing test and be able to convince us it is human rather than a machine? Not quite yet. Robots, the exhibition runs until early September.